if there was a bad boy thing, I wouldn't know probably because I was never close enough to the brink of the bad boy thing. Drew, your character cares so much about animals in the film that she won't even wear makeup. Um, right. That's something most women would be terrified to do. How did you pull it off so well? Um, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> do you have some tips for fresh face looks? Um, I think uh, just I think if you're happy on the inside, that that is the most important place to start with um, looking and feeling your best, and uh, and then a good concealer. Nice. <laughs> and nice. what do you do to stay happy on the inside? Um, I just try to remember what's important and just keep everything balanced and you know do the things that I love and be around the people that I love the most. Yeah. John, your character, like Jim in The Office, is a very nice guy. Do you think Thank women you. are finally getting away from the bad boy thing? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> She's the one to answer that probably more than me. I did, if there was a bad boy thing, I wouldn't know probably because I was never close enough to the brink of the bad boy thing. <laughs> um, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. I, I, I love playing guys that, that uh, you know, definitely have... Uh, a, a nice sensibility but the thing about this character that was really nice is the conflict you know the conflict to um, want something more and decide whether or not it was it was the right thing to want and at the end of the day he, he realized that what he always really wanted was to be right where he was. Drew, uh, Valentine's Day is coming up and you're newly engaged is this one going to be a special Valentine's for you? I, I mean I think so. of course <laughs> yes. Yeah. What would your ideal date night be? I love going to an old revival movie. By the way, speaking of old movies, I get to, I got to, uh, I am the curator with Robert Osborne for the essentials on Turner Classic Movies all next, all this Whoa. year. Wow. Yeah, I went and shot it in New York. And so my love of old movies paid off in the way that I got to get this great gig. That's awesome. And I get to discuss 30 different old films with Robert Osborne on Turner Classic Movies all year. That's, That's amazing. Awesome. I think Sullivan's Travels would be a great amazing. Valentine's Day movie this year for anyone to see. Amazing. And John, do you have anything special planned for your wife, Emily? We always just kind of do uh, regular stuff, like going out to dinner and and things like that. I mean, again, it's all about the, the time you're spending with the person. Uh, maybe it's just nowadays, but it feels to me like the most fun is just the, the time you spend, not what you're actually doing. Um, so it's really fun. And how did you know Emily was right for you? Uh, <laughs> for so many reasons that we definitely don't have time to go into. But, <laughs> um, no, she's pretty incredible, and, and I knew it right away.